So if you're going to sew leather, you got to think about threading the needle. And this is an interesting process because you've got this woven fiber wax thread and it's really good at holding itself together. And you got to get the thing cut to a point. And then usually what I'll do is I'll rake my thumb across the surface like so. And then you've got to slide it inside your needle. And then the trick is you're not going to tie a big knot because as you're weaving back and forth through the leather, it's just going to cause a ton of drag and force your thread to break. So what you do is you actually bring, you know, three or four inches just floating off the edge of the needle and you're going to pierce through the threading, right? You're going to actually impale the threading with itself using the needle. And you don't just want like a little tiny fiber. You want to get a fair amount of fiber on either side like that. And then, here's the tricky part, you're going to push it all the way down to the base, and then you're going to pull this thread back through the eye, scooch it down, pull it through, scooch it down, pull it through, until it's one continuous knot. And I don't mean knot as in you tied a knot, but just sort of like getting tangled within itself, and then you just wipe the wax fibers along themselves, get that in focus, along themselves so that it behaves like one continuous thread. So what I'll do is I'll just run my fingers along the surface and gently twist and that will ensure that the needle goes through the leather without issue. Grab a little piece of leather to show you what we're talking about. So we just want to find one of the holes that was already cut with the chisel and it's just going to go straight through, okay? And so when you're sewing with your two components together, there'll be a second needle tied to the other end of this thread that's coming through the opposite side of the exact same hole. And that's all you need to know in preparation for sewing leather with hand stitching.